Vanessa, Pierre Barbarel. Here you are again. Yeah, again. Representing France. Yeah. It's the fourth time? It's the fifth. Fifth time. Fifth time. Yeah. And last year you had a uh, silver medal. But you cannot have have a medal every year, so I won't have a medal this year. So Am I looking at you nude behind you? Are you looking at the what? You nude? Uh, yeah, exactly. It's me nude. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us a little bit about it. So this uh, triptych is uh, is uh, called Templum, uh, and it's ex an extract from a, uh, a big ex exhibition about what's gonna left of us when we are dead. And uh, so I decided to um, separate the, the body, like making falling pieces, uh, and use the pixels that compose the, the photography to talk about the cells that all together rebuild the, uh, the material and the body. And so it was a um, mix between the body going back to the to the sea and uh, to the clouds. Yeah. And do you think a lot about the body and obsession and water and death? Uh, yeah, I am quite obsessed with uh, with death and uh, what's gonna left of us. And, uh, what sparked that? Why? Yeah. Oh. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> but do you, know. But and do, water? Water, water, because it's the the place where I feel the more comfortable, like uh, reminding or of uh, the wound. No, you say the wound. womb. Womb? How? Womb. Womb. Yeah. Where you womb. came from? Yeah, yeah. I feel really comfortable when I go really far uh, into the sea, and that I I let myself go in the water, then you don't hear anything, and it's really quiet, calm, I really like this feeling. But isn't that your work also more like uh, mystic, for instance, when the body that you put it like that looks like a Jesus Christ, it looks like, you know, this kind of uh, Leonardo da Vinci drawings, isn't that more the inspiration also about the classicism in your, in your work? Yeah, absolutely. Classicism is always uh, running into my, my work and I'm quite obsessed with it also because uh, there's always, for me, uh, there's always this uh, obsession about uh, God or me or where we come from, where we're gonna go and, uh, and yeah, so that's... It looks like... And, and actually the title is Templum, which is and the... This is the artist over here. This, which is a, a way of uh, separate the space and uh, uh, before to read the augurs you had to put a square in the sky and then the direction of the birds on the left or on the right uh, were meaningful. So if they were going on the left, Dexter, it was a bad uh, omen, and if they were going to the right, it was a good one. So again, you are into all the allegories and about the mythology. About yeah, the yeah. Things. it's really important. Yes, but it looks like, because I mean, this is, you know, what it is. It is always, you know, the, 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 the meaning of an artist is to link, you know, with the history, you know, with the myth. myth. And with his own life also. Of course, of course. So, okay. Your eyes look even more blue today. Thank you. <laughs> so, give us the address and tell us how long going to be here. It's, so, the address is uh, Le Grand Palais. And you can come every day from 11 to 20 or... or uh, no, you say not 20, you said 8. 8 or, or 10, it depends on, on the day. And... Um, and it's a free entrance or you need to pay? No, you need to pay, but I, I don't know the price, but ah, I okay. think it's no quite way. expensive. Yeah, but it's worth it anyhow. Yeah, of course. Okay. Absolutely. So, we're going to uh, do one little song.